Welcome to the Crazy Down Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm Ike the Explosive One. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Yo. Your boy came out with some shoes. My boy. Treesies. My boy. Yeah, your boy. The <laughs> trumpet. The Air Force Ones. Yeah. The, the what they call them? The Fake Force Ones or the Fraud Force Ones, I think. Is that what they call the shoes that he put out? Yeah, they've been calling them the Fraud Force Ones or the... There's another name for them. I can't remember that Twitter was calling them. So, uh, yeah, so Trump got judgmented for $355 million. The next day, he's at ShoeCon. J- judgmented, I love. <laughs> <laughs> I love judgmented. Yeah. yeah, he judgmented, and then uh, he got the... Uh, yeah, if you're on the channel, those look really nice. I'm really glad that it's moving. Yeah, yeah. There's, I mean... Solid gold shoes. So after... American flag on the side. After Trump got fined 300 and... What was it? $312 million? He got fined. He got judgmented. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> after he's got after he got his after he owes money. He owes three hundred and fifty or three hundred and twelve million dollars to the state of New York. He can no longer conduct business in New York for the next two years. Three um, years. You're a little off. Truth not facts. That's fine. It's fine. A couple years. Next couple years in. Yeah. Fine. Three years. Um he decided to drop a shoe in order to what three ninety nine. Ap- what it appears as though an attempt to make money. Um, I mean, that's what you sell things for. Yeah, if you go to the website, um, the shoes are sold out. Uh, mm. Metallic shoes are in. Are they? Always. So, I guess, Jonas, the thing is, it's like, the man the man is going through some legal trouble, all right? And I'm not, I'm not copping any pleas. I don't have any schadenfreude. You shouldn't and- have started a GoFundMe. I mean, that, he probably he actually does already. There's already a GoFundMe for Trump. That's funny enough. You should mention that. It got to about twenty thousand dollars. That's it. Yeah, other people's money, man. I don't know what you. <laughs> and there's obviously you can donate directly to his uh, his campaign. Um, that's you know, but that if you donate to his campaign, he can't use that money to do anything. Either way, I don't have any Schadenfreude, which means like I'm not like haha sticking one to the Trump. Nor do I have any sympathy. Where I'm like, oh, poor Trump. All right, I'm not on either side of that fence. It's just I'm not. not me. I don't even know what a fence is right now. But I do say is that it. I mean, look, it seems like a good idea. You sell shoes. If I had a following of people, yeah, whether just or unjust, mm-hmm. for the right or wrong reasons, uh-huh. and I was like, oh man, I gotta pay a lot of money out, and I was like, I got these. I got these golden tickets in my back pocket, no pun intended. Mm-hmm. Let me put them out, sell them up, get my fans to champ at the bit for my shoes. Walk a mile in my shoes. Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see any of the footage of when he actually dropped the shoe? He dropped it on the ground? Did you see any of the footage of when he actually released the shoe? <laughs> uh, he was talking about something. Okay, fair enough. Uh, so, yeah, he went to Philadelphia to release his shoe. He went to a sneaker convention. Mm-hmm. Um, went to Sneaker Con. Mm-hmm. And, uh, so there's he, a bunch of sneaker heads there. He was met with a litany of boos from I the crowd. I heard that. I did hear did he you, got booed. Okay, you, did, you, didn't hear, you didn't hear it. You didn't see it, though. No. I, no. I, don't have that, I don't have that up right now. But it was crazy like how many boos he was getting and as a president as any uh, official delegate official elected by the people you have to be nice even when these people are being mean to you so it's philadelphia they're known for their 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 rude behavior oh yeah so people are like boo you know get out of here fuck you trump and he's just like oh there's a lot of emotion in this room <laughs> <laughs> see there's a lot of emotion that's nice. That's nice. You know, he's just kind of taking golden, it. Buy my golden shoes. Yeah, you know, you know, he wants to snap. You can see like the look of sm- like I the vein see- pulsing on the side of his you head. Can see it. You can see it in his face. Jonas, what do what do you think about a president releasing shoes? Does it does it seem a little unbecoming of a president Oof. or a former president? What in would this the Obamas case? look like? <laughs> I have to say they look better than these pieces of I shit. I feel like the Obamas would be fine. <laughs> these, these things look like ass, man. All right? Look, let's, let's bring the shoes up. Let's bring the shoes up. <laughs> go, to the cra- go to the crazytown.com. Go to the YouTube. Fucking give these shoes a proper roasting. 
All right, I just want to see the Trump shoes. You, you got the. There's no. You put. You got. You got. You put black. Black in. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. Trump <laughs> shoes. Give me those. Ooh. All right, let's just let's just get in here real nice and deep. Okay. I don't want to actually get that deep. That's too deep. Scroll down. Ooh, I want this, and then I just want to look. So, what do you, what do you think, Jones? What's the first idea that comes to your mind? Oh, uh, it looks like. It, it looks like the Tin Man from Wizard of Oz left his shoes at the homeless shelter. <laughs> so, uh, oh, I love how the the stripe, the, the the American. So, what are these based? These are like based off of like high tops. They're not like Chuck Taylors. No, no, they're they kind of look like Chuck Taylors. They kind of look like high top Air Force Ones a little it, bit. It looks like he bought shoes from Walmart and spray painted them gold. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah. but there's an American flag around the top, you know. No, that's not cutting it for me. The three striped flag with the five stars. Here's the thing. If okay. I if I see him wearing the shoes, oh, then you might have me a he little. He should have worn them out. He should have. I guarantee you that you will never see him wear a pair of these. And that's the real effed up thing. It's does, like if you're going to really wear Yeezys. What's that? Does Kanye wear Yeezys? Of course. Of course. Why would you not? If I came your out shoes. with Jonies, I'd wear them. It's your shoes. It made you millions of dollars. Of course you're going to wear your shoe. That's why, you know, and it's advertising for your shoe. You see me wearing the shoe. You already want the shoe. Now you see your favorite person associate. Yeah. It's like it's an Ouroboros of just money. Yeah. Right? It's free advertising. I mean, it still sold out, though. It did sell out. So three, $399 a pop. They sold out within, like, minutes. Of course. Anything and I, does. And I have to say, Jonas, like, I don't know. You clip, got a pair that's coming? I, I have to say is that the clip uh, of the uh, the Fox News guy saying is that these shoes will appeal to the black community has been floating around. Have you seen that one? No. You, don't see you haven't seen that one? I kind of want to play it even at the risk. I kind of want to play it for you. I did. Have I mean, a, I can look at it offline. I had it loaded up, though. It was It was this clip. I can't play it from the Daily Beast. We're not doing that. Yeah, Either way, it was anyways. a clip, and, and the guy basically says is that uh, that Trump is tapping into the urban communities with the shoe. And uh, oh, he was like, yeah, uh, he was like, black people they love sneakers, and <laughs> <laughs> and this is a way for him to resonate in in those communities. So he's trying to rip off the black community by having four hundred dollars sneakers. Um, I mean, I didn't realize that we were so easily swayed. Like, all of a sudden, everybody's just going to be like... Like, oh, shit, Trump dropped some sneakers. I guess I'll vote for I'll him I'll forget now. all the stuff he did. And then I think it's Tommy Lauren. She says something about, do you think that even if they buy the shoes, that these will translate into votes? And he's like, well, I think if you spend three ninety nine on on a pair of shoes, I think that translates to something. So, yeah, I think they'll vote for him, too. Brother... Ain't nothing better than when you see a, a room full of, of white people who probably don't even have a black friend talking about black shit. That's the best. <laughs> That's the best. That is the best. Like they've never even like met a black person in life. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm look, I'm here for it. I'm here for I'm here for the, just the misguided, <laughs> unintentional racism. I love that. Misguided, ish. unintentional. Oh yeah. Like they don't even know any better. Like like they're so that, oblivious they don't even know it's that, racist. That like the purity of a child enveloped in this like racial cognitiveness. It's just it's one of my favorite things in the world. And I actually I watch Fox News, so I don't want anybody to give me any shit about like Fox news doesn't you know usually they're okay outliers are out of the park <laughs> out of the park when they say something crazy it's usually the craziest shit you've ever heard ever in life and they need to be indicted for it but yeah so trump shoes out you got black people go get them black people go get them is that <laughs> what you just said <laughs> okay i guess that's what we're supposed to do right <laughs> He made them for you. <laughs> I guess. I guess so. Okay. I, funny enough, I didn't get a pair. God uh, damn it. I, I wish I had. Honestly, Joe, I'm not going to lie. I would have highly considered it. 
I do not want to fund this man in any way, uh, shape, or form. Nor do I want to fund Biden in any way, shape, or form. But <laughs> I you, would if love you have 400 to throw away, bro. I'm not gonna lie to step out and go to the club on on uh, on Sunday in a pair of Trump shoes would have been the best feeling in the world. <laughs> I, I don't know, but sure. World. You have a weird way of feeling things. So apparently these shoes, you can't even get them now. Um, the website is uh, the Trump website where he also sells cologne. He sells a couple other. Cologne? I yeah, he's he sold oh. Trump cologne before. Trump oh. steaks, Trump vodka, Trump cologne, the Trump college, Trump towers, the Trump casino hotel. All, by the way, which are failed businesses. Um, just putting it out there. It's the truth. Uh, but yeah, apparently it's on the same website. There's Trump cologne. Um, there's Trump like just like Trump merch. The man moves merch. I'll give him that. He moves merch. He's but like a wrestler. Kind of, kind of. Like I mean, he just like he just he's just like oh I got this new hanky and everyone's like oh I'll blow my nose on a Trump sock. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I, I, yeah. Like a social influencer, I guess. You know, like has a Twitch following. <laughs> <laughs> Trump goes on Twitch. Honestly, bro. Honestly, Him Trump on Twitch, house, just chilling, just yeah. doing an in real life stream, just yeah, like, just playing Fortnite, just playing <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> My God, Trump playing Pal World on stream. I would definitely. I'm sorry. I'm watching that if it happens. All right, we'll sign him up. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe for Jonas. T T. Oh, uh, we have.